Hi guys, this is Darren from American Pride Power Equipment. Here today to talk to you about the new Ultima uh, Zero Turns with Lat Bars, just to walk you through the starting procedures and some of the features and benefits that you're gonna see. So some of the features that have made these new Ultimas extremely popular are the very low center of gravity. The gas tanks are tucked underneath the seats rather than up on the fender wells like you see common with a lot of other zero turns. The heavy duty tubular frame and LED lights are new for the Ultimas. Many different adjustments that are capable on the lap bars make customizing the lap bars very comfortable. So when setting your deck height, you're gonna use your foot pedal to take pressure off of the deck, then use the knob to select your deck height. Here in Ohio, we like to say that you're somewhere between um, around a three to three and a half inches for non-treated grass. Treated grass is hopefully up in the four to four and a half inch range. Once you set your deck height, you can allow the deck to come back to you. Again, as you're going, if I get to those areas where you've just got little settle rough areas or roots or crest of a hill, places that those decks are gonna scalp. You do have anti-scalp wheels on the front of that deck that will help to move it up, but we prefer to use that foot pedal. Now that's what the professionals use in order to keep from digging in and scalping. So as you get to that area, just simply apply pressure with your foot, feather that deck over that area, then simply let the deck come back down. Cub Cadet has made starting your new Ultima Zero Turn extremely easy. Automatic parking brakes on the lap bars make it easy to know when to start. Your lap bars have to be out, which makes your parking brake be on. Throttle, about half throttle, and a choke, and which would allow you to then start your mower. Some models will have your choke all the way up at the top of your throttle, which just would mean you'd throttle all the way up, then turn your mower on, then throttle back down. To engage the blades on your Cub Cadet Ultima, simply pull up on your electric PTO switch, and that turns your blades on. To turn them off, simply to press the blades. We'd like to ideally do that at about three quarters throttle, turn the blades on, then throttle all the way up, then use my lap bars to control my speed. But we should always mow full throttle. That's what gets the blade tips moving at the correct blade tip speed, keeps the battery charged. It's actually easier on that engine mowing at full throttle than at less than full throttle. We don't want to engage the blades at half throttle or less as there would not be enough tension on the belts. The belts could tend to flop around and damage the belts. So always be at at least three quarters throttle when engaging those blades. Just to go through some of the basic maintenance items on your new Cub Cadet Ultima Zero Turn. Now your engine could be a little bit different than this engine, but they all have the same basic principles. All of them will have a dipstick in order to check your engine oil. All of them will have an oil filter and an oil drain, most of which are pre-tubed, which means the engine oil is already tubed off and very convenient to change the oil. Some units, have serviceable transmissions, which allow you to change the oil and the fluid in the transmissions, allowing for longer life. Those units will have reservoirs, which you will want to check consistently to make sure there are some fluid in those reservoirs. This here is about perfect, in between the bottom full cold line and the writing in the middle. Any more than this, when the fluid gets hot, it will come up out the top. Cub Cadet has made it very convenient if you need to disengage your transmissions. Just simply pull the lever out on the back, next to located next to the engine, on each side. That will disengage each transmission, allowing you to freewheel. Then disengage your parking brake, and then you can push the unit or pull the unit as needed. 